Hey, what's up, boxing fans? Miguel Maravilla here with you, bringing you a fight preview of Conor Ben versus Peter Dobson. This being uh, Conor Ben's uh, Las Vegas debut, as uh, he joins many UK fighters to uh, pretty much make their splash. It's his opportunity to make his case in the welterweight division. He's uh, looking to become a major player in the division. He's the son of a legend. And then you have Dobson. This is his opportunity to uh, pretty much derail all of uh, Ben's plans. As you know, as mentioned, he is the son of a legend. So there's a lot of high expectations for him. Uh, a lot of potential, a lot of knockout power for uh, Connor Ben as he keeps uh, steamrolling over the competition. This is a platform for him to pretty much uh, catapult himself to get onto the big stage. But as mentioned, Dobson has his opportunity and he's looking to cash in on this. We shall see. Take a look. Goes down February 3rd at the Chelsea at the Cosmopolitan in Las Vegas. As Connor Ben takes on Peter Dobson. Dobson, 16 and 0, nine knockouts from the Bronx. He uh, was on a Pacquiao undercard in 2019. So this technically is not a fir the first big stage he's on. He's won five straight since, and he is coming off a unanimous decision over Rodrigo Correa in his last fight. For Ben, 22 and 0, 14 knockouts from Essex, England. The son of the legend, former WBC champion, Nigel Ben. His notable wins come over uh, Samuel Vargas, Adrian Granados, Chris Algieri, Chris Van Heerden. Just uh, the name. He is coming off a uh, unanimous decision over Rodolfo Orozco in his U.S. debut. Now he looks to shine under the lights in Sin City. I like Conor Ben in this fight. It's obvious. It's it's his opportunity. It's his stage. It's it's uh, his time. I, um, you know, I see Dobson giving him a, a few uh, difficult rounds from the beginning. Uh, I don't think it's going to be as easy. I don't think he's going to go out there and, uh, you know, give that explosive knockout in the first round early on. I, I think it's he's going to uh, have to adjust to uh, Dobson. Dobson is no pushover. So I mean, you know, I look for this fight to. Uh, uh, go late, uh, possibly even go the distance. But, uh, you know, uh, again, uh, most of these UK fighters, they uh, they come to the U.S. Uh, maybe a fight or two after. It's when they start to uh, get tested. So I think this will be the case as, uh, again, Dobson, a lot on the line. He uh, pretty much uh, is going to go out there and make the most of it. But again, I like Ben in this fight. 